Okay, so today we're here with Taylor and Ben, and we get to experience a little bit of water skiing with On the Edge. So Taylor, what was it like to be a volunteer and tell us your background, where you're from, what it was like to volunteer, and then to participate and learn to ski? Yeah, hi, I'm Taylor. Um, I'm from Thurmont, Maryland, which is really close to where On the Edge is and everything. Um, I go down, I go to school down in Tennessee for a therapeutic recreation, so all this stuff is right up my alley. I had a friend who had, she's been doing this for I think like three or four years now or something like that, and she encouraged me to come out to an event, and at this, I've done two so far, and after the first one, I that's when I knew I wanted, I wanted to do more than just kind of, the first event I was doing a little bit, not a whole lot, and I wanted to do more, so I wanted to learn how to ski and become a flank skier. What was it like to learn to ski? Really fun, really fun. A little nervous, a little nerve wracking at first, but it's more exciting than it is scary. Good, and your goal is to flank and ski yes, in sir. July, right? Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> so we need lots of flankers, we need lots of volunteers for all the big events, so please come out and join us. Would you recommend this to others? I would, it's so fun and it's so rewarding. And I haven't even been out skiing yet and it's already been so rewarding. And I can only imagine how much more it's, I'm, it's how much greater it's going to feel once I get out skiing with them. Okay, great. Thank you. Ben, how about you? Well, to start off, um, a gentleman named Brandon had offered me, you know, he saw me in the gym, said, you know, you could probably help out with, with this kind of inspiration because there's a lot of people with my situation, missing limbs and whatnot, um, disabled, disabled children. And, you know, I, did, I wasn't sure what, what, he, what he was asking me. Um, I, and I heard, about, I, it was about a year I didn't hear from him and I, I was thinking it, I fell off, but he contacted me and got me in touch with Bob and, and Diane Casper and got brought me out here. And uh, again, it's, it's, I found out again, I lived the life of living the fast lane, bartending, all that kind of thing. And money was everything, but I found out it's the reward of gratitude and just seeing the smiles on people's faces, kids' faces. Um, it's, it's so much more rewarding than having that dollar in your pocket. Like I, I don't, I don't, I, I want to give as much a time as I can to on the edge, find other nonprofits that I can give back to because it really is, it, it's, it's touching, man. It's, I had, again, little short stories that was a little girl here that, um, so it was big brother, big sister th uh, event. And you know, you don't know what they're going through. You know, you don't ask because you don't want to make them uncomfortable. You could tell she was, she was a little nervous, a little shy. And there was about three or four adults that asked her to, to do the rock climbing event. And she, she was, no, didn't want to. You could tell she wanted to. And you know, I was, I, I, I just, I grew up there. I, again, I, I'm, I've been nervous talking. As you can see, I'm, I'm stuttering through my words, but I was like, you know what, just, just do it. This is the, you're, you're, it's small baby steps. And I said to her, I was like, look, you know, I, 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 I think you want, I want, I want to do it too. I'm, I'm nervous. Um, you know, just don't make me look bad. You got you gotta, you can't beat me up there because I think you're going to be pretty fast. And she broke a smile and she went and did the rock wall. And again, like I said, it's just, it's so touching, man. It, it, it warms your heart to see what you can do. And giving, again, giving back is so much more than, than I don't care what that dollar does for you. Cool. So what was it like for you learning to ski? Um, it was, it was a obstacle that I, I needed to come. I'm a perfectionist and I, I, you know, I struggled. I was, I was an irritated with myself, but again, it was, it was each step was, was rewarding and it just felt good. You know, it was, what did you get to do today? Um, I got to try slalom skiing for the first time, do one ski. And I have, again, my, my short term memory. I just, I, I keep thinking, I keep leaning forward. And I, I busted my face. Like I said, I'm a perfectionist. So I, I wanted to, I wanted to do it, but I got up and it's it, again that's the first step next time i, I will ride and I'll, I'll be jumping in no time awesome congratulations thank you all right thank you